What's up, Paige? It's your girl Queen L. Eats. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And this is Tweezy Flex. And today we're eating from Tacos Blah Blah Blah. That's blah, right. Blah Blah Blah. Tacos Blah Blah Blah. That's what's the name. That's the name of the restaurant. Hint. Let's see, Tacos <laughs> Blah Blah Blah. Blah Blah Blah. All right. Well, today I have Bria Tacos. Blah blah, blah Blah Blah. I have Bria Tacos. All right. I really wanted to try a different Bria. Taco from a different place because the last place was good, but it didn't have as much seasoning as I felt like it would have had. Mm -hmm. I felt like it needed a little bit more flavor. I guess I'm spoiled on my own because <laughs> I made them myself and they were really good and flavorful. So that particular place didn't have as much flavor. That Everybody I can't doing. cook like Queen Air. I'm just saying. He trying to make it feel the expectations kind of high. He, <laughs> When you comparing off your own food. But that is true. I, I can't compare. So I'm going to compare to tacos, blah, 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 to the other restaurant where I got the... What's the name of the spot again? Uh, oh. Cucho's. All right. We're going to see how that tastes. And does it have the flavor I'm looking for And taco, blah, blah, blah. All right. What you got over there? I have a Big Beep Burrito. That's the name of it. Big Beep. Burrito. Oh, that's the name of a big beat burrito. It's just called burrito, but it's big. <laughs> and I ain't want to curse. Oh, that is a big burrito. That's, that's a big burrito. All right. Yeah, I'm ready to eat, y'all. Let's say I pray and get it in. You trying to close it up? Okay. Let's say I pray and get it in. Heavenly Father, bless over this food for the nourishment of our bodies. Let it give us health, strength, and knowledge and everything you would have of us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Oh, we do have funnel cake fries as well. Funnel cake fries. And we have strawberry sauce. I'm excited, y'all. I'm going to try two for you. I'm ready to try it. I hope it tastes like mine. I smell an oniony smell. Okay. Let's try it. Same feeling. It's all right. It just ain't touching mine. <laughs> it ain't touching mine because they said they dip it in the sauce. They said they dip the tacos in the sauce and then fry it on the grill. Well, put it on the grill so that the sauce can take flavor in the um, taco. We are falling apart. But I don't taste it like I did in mine. That's a bit real. Oh, now you what you have in that shrimp? Mm -hmm. Shrimp, black beans, rice, lettuce, tomato. I'm gonna not dust to them. But I don't think they can beat my homemade. I'm about to give up on that. Mm. Mm. I'm hungry. <laughs> Y'all gonna have to make me some hash. I ain't had no hash in a long time. Hash is good. When the last time y'all had hash? Yeah, what flavor we got left? What kind of flavor? We got grape. Um, pineapple in it. Pineapple? Mm, mm -hmm. I don't think so.
Yeah, yeah, it's okay, but I really do feel like if I made it home. It'll be more busting. So the question is, are you gonna make it? Probably not. <laughs> You know what? I might just make some. I, I'm saying I, I won't. Y'all, I ain't gonna lie. It's a lot of work. Like I said on the last video, it's a lot of work. Gotta you gotta cook, feel gotta it. Cook that rose. And yeah, yeah, cook the rose. And it's a yeah, lot. Yeah. You gotta be in the mood for it. You gotta be in the mood. So, yeah. This one of those mood foods. <laughs> You can't be in a hurry. You know what? That's something that you would cook. If you already cooked pot roast and you got some left. Yeah. That would make you want to do it because you'd be like, let me change it up. You know, if you already cooked the pot roast and you got and you already got the roast left and you like, I want to eat something different, but I don't want to waste my food, you would do it then. I would do it then. But it's okay. Now I gotta get both of the restaurants are okay for the burrito. Not gonna say nasty because it ain't nasty. It just like Tweezy said, my expectations was a little high because the first time I ate them was when I cooked, mm -hmm. so I was able to put my own flavors in it, along with the peppers and onions and all that good stuff. Mm. Mm. Hope just fell apart. Got used to nachos to eat. For real. Yeah. Let me get some of the fun fries for you, fool. Drop a couple of those things. in the spot. Definitely hitting the spot. What's up? I'm gonna probably do that. That look good. You need a strawberry. Well, put me some right there. I'm trying to have strawberry over there. Strawberry sauce on. That's the main thing she be looking forward to every time when the car wins. A phone pay. Any amusement park we go to. <laughs> I'm looking for a funnel cake. A funnel cake that has ice cream, strawberry, and chocolate syrup. She's looking it up. I'm good. That's what I want. <laughs> every time. Every time. We ain't leaving till she get that funnel cake. We can actually go in there and not ride nothing. I get to stop <laughs> and get that funnel cake. That was good though. That was like a regular french fry on it. That's good. That's real good. Mm hmm. Look like ketchup. <laughs> I think it's good. Ooh. I go back and order that. So I need some farm fries. A cup of water. This is good. And a cup of water. What's this icing? That's cheese. Cheese. Icing. That's cheese. Cheese for the Chips. I messed it up. Taste it. I could be wrong. I hope you are. 
Hej, det kunne jeg. Vi ser icing. Se det ass. She poured it then ass. But get what? She ain't nasty. It ain't just good. She, it make it taste like cheesecake. She poured it. Then she asked, what is this? Uh, <laughs> cheese. But it do my, remind me of a cheesecake now because it got that kick to it like a cheesecake do. I mean, I guess cheese is cheese. <laughs> So, Still good. Want your drink? Yeah. You laughing at me? <laughs> I'm just happy it wasn't nothing crazy to mess it up, you know? Cause it didn't mess it up. It just made it taste like a cheesecake. I probably won't drink this. I probably just like, you know, taste it. Because I need my water. Excuse me. Let me stop. Let me just taste this. Because <laughs> I want to eat all of them up. There you go. Ain't good. I got some more to the side. Okay. This burrito was gigantic. Fell apart. That's good. That's good. The mandarin flavor went good. I thought I messed up some and it ain't even messed up. That's how good it is. I was like, dog, I messed it up. It ain't even messed up. It reminds me of a cheesecake. Mm. That tomato sauce is good. That's what it is. You want to try it? It's just tomato sauce. Okay. I like that they did that. Just tomato sauce. Definitely cheese. <laughs> it went and perfect with these chips. <laughs> That's the word we got to drink tomato juice every day. Was it healthy? No. He was older. So I guess you're trying to get healthy. Some people drink them V8s every day. He drink tomato juice. But then have like he this is all he did. He ate bologna sandwiches and drank tomato juice every day at work. But bologna sandwich, it'd be about six, seven stacks of bologna. He was throwing down. Thick ones. Cold. I can eat a cold bologna sandwich. Not I bet you can't eat that many bologna's cold. Not that many, no. Mm -mm. And it gotta be beef, because that many cold pork <laughs> bologna piece of bologna on there. Amulet's gonna pick me up. <laughs> And one time, so when the break was here, man, it's probably about 10 years ago. He sat in one particular seat in mm -hmm. a little room where we had the meetings at. Mm -hmm. A new person came, set their bag stuff on his spot. He come in there, looked at it, and we all looking like, oh, oh. like, what he going to do? I didn't think he was going to do this. He picked that stuff up, threw it across the room. <clears throat> we sitting there like, oh my God, what's wrong with him? What's wrong with you? What? The, I hope he got some kind of reprimand. No. You didn't? <laughs> no. Nobody can say nothing. I, I, I laughed. I was young too. I was like 21. <laughs> it, it couldn't have been my little <laughs> <food. laughs> 
And we know who we don't even know who stuff it was. Oh, okay. And then the first there's a new person. Then we then then we find who the new person was and they're trying to figure out why why this stuff with us out in the room. They didn't they didn't know he threw it. Yeah. Man, uh uh. <laughs> <laughs> Tell you, some people are trying. I guess so. You ain't got to do all that. Like you said, you was younger. That's why you thought it was funny. How old are you? Do you now want to thought that was funny? I'm like, come on, man. What's come your on. problem? What's wrong with you? Good to go. It's gonna be crazy. And the the people I used to work with who watches our videos, they gonna die laughing they hear that because they know they exactly, know exactly, they know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> they lived it with you. <laughs> <laughs> it's like. Mm. Funniest moment. It do be a trip. Mm -hmm. Now my, my top of my ear itching. Full, yeah. The burrito was it was big. Um, wasn't a lot of flavor. It was huge. You say it wasn't a lot of flavor. It wasn't a lot of flavor. Uh, matter of fact, you can just eat one of these shrimps. You you is giving me a shrimp now that yeah he don't know much share no shrimp. <laughs> it don't it tastes like the beans that it'll decide. <laughs> it will taste like no salt, no pepper, nothing. Like I'm and I'm and I'm for real with mine. It went nasty, but if you a person who like flavors. You would be disappointed because you're not ready to get a flavor. You you know what I'm saying? How you like, ooh, that's a good flavor. And Queen Hill would tell you, I season the food out of my food. I season it. Season. He seasoned. I ain't even, look. And and sometimes it hit a miss. Now sometimes it might be too much. Yeah. I'm gonna season that. I'm gonna season that thing. <laughs> that's true. And like I said, you know, the most seasoning I taste is the onions, and it's not seasoning, that's a it's the onion. Onion and, and strong. That's the thing. You can season it good without salt. So you can. I mean, sometimes your natural flavors are really good, but it wouldn't hurt. You know, just two, two dabs of salt, like just a little bit of salt, boop, boop. bro. Just a little bit. A pinch. Two pinches. Now who's that? <laughs> there was a dude that was doing a video yeah, on no, Facebook. Yeah. He had a sea, no, it was a meat platter. He was meat. Meat. He has filet. He has filet. That was a trip. Yeah, it was a trip. But yeah, y'all, y'all would ever want to try the burrito tacos? I would try these before you make your own. That way, you would know. Okay, this is this is how a normal one tastes. Mm -hmm. So let me let me put some more flavor in mine because it's gonna not have as much flavor if I do it. Try to do it exactly like that. One. Now the only thing, to my knowledge. I think the only thing you would switch up with yours is you would get small tortillas. Because then you had the big tortillas last time. Yeah. yeah. I had big tortillas. She had the big ones. So you would get a smaller tortilla. And what else? I didn't put all those hot chilies in mine. Like, and it tastes like they didn't either. Because mm -hmm. it's not hot, which is good. And I think, you know what? I might have just solved the problem. They can't make it exactly like they normally would. And sell it in a restaurant because it'll be too hot. If yeah, they too. actually use those chilies and oh everything that comes in the recipe, it will be so hot you can't eat it. Because remember, I had made ours and I put the little chilies in it, but I didn't put a lot of chilies, but it still was hot. Mm -hmm. We was like, whoo, the flavor <laughs> good, but whoo. So that could be it. it could that be. could be the, they they got to make it to where they can sell it at the restaurant for everybody. Makes sense. Makes it sense. makes sense. It makes sense. So yeah, like I said, that way you can know if you taste it. That way you can know. Okay, well maybe 
I can stand a little heat with it. Put a, you know, put a little more seasoning with it. But yeah, you are limited when you have a restaurant. <sighs> you are limited on what you can do as far as heat. You gotta accommodate everybody. Cause we ain't accommodate nobody with no flavor. <sighs> Crickets. Crickets. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he off the chain. He is off the chain. All right, y'all. We're going to go ahead on and show y'all what I got from Ben Time. I feel like I got a good deal this time. I feel like I got a good deal. All right, we'll be back at. Hold up, hold up. We're going to see her on the, the TLC channel. No, you're not. You're not going to see me on orders. No, you're not going to see me on orders. Buying. Buying. I took. Look, 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 look hold up. Cause last time she spent fifty something dollars. Well, this time I only spent thirty. Yeah, I remember it. But she, I didn't get thirty. And she told me, and, and, hold on, she told me she's gonna go spend twenty. So I just found out right now. But anyway, she said she's gonna spend ten dollars a piece. I said, I said, listen, Queen Elle, slow down a little bit. This stuff's starting to accumulate a little bit. She said, well, I'm only gonna spend twenty dollars. And I said, well, a dollar day, that's twenty things. But my stuff was more than a dollar. They have like a specialty section, y'all, that has more expensive stuff than a dollar. Mm -hmm. And my baby, I'm not talking about my wife, my five-year-old got daddy a gift. It was $10? And made, and made sure she got it. She was going to I spent it. a total of $36. Take that 10 off. While, while I was, listen. While I, was at work, while I was at work, she made sure daddy got something. She can't even show did. She said, I got to get that for daddy, mama. I got to get it for daddy. Got to get it. It was a, a South Carolina Gamecock rug. It was $10. And she said, I want to get it to, get it for him. I want to buy it for him. <laughs> so we went out, went on ahead and got it. Tweezy one with me. It was me, Leah, Kenzie, Adrian, and AJ. And y'all, they cut up. When I tell y'all, they cut up in that wagon. There were angels in the wagon. I had a vision. Mm -hmm. that they were just... Prince and princess. I said, I got to get up out of him. That's how bad it is. I want them jeans. See, I got Ken's and Adrian a pair of jeans. Blue jeans. They was in the $5 section. Like I said, they got it sectioned off. She don't show y'all. Yeah, they got it. No, I can't show them the jeans. Because honey, Ken's, I read them over them to school. <laughs> <laughs>